What's up guys? My name is Jess and welcome back to my channel. So for today, we're just like kind of out running some errands. Babe's here. Book's here. He's out of school for the summer, so he's all ours. He's gonna be hanging out all summer. It's lit, basically, but we're um, about to get some lunch. We're actually pulling him now. Thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna get the lettuce wet. I don't know these wings. Yeah, what you gonna get? A burger? No. What? Soup. Soup. What did you get? Like My wedge. <laughs> Book got some corn bisque. Some wings. And then Babe is over here eating so good. Mm. Steak, broccoli, mac and cheese. I will not be partaking, but that's okay. I am drinking some wine. Chianti wine. So we picked Gigi up from school. Don't mind her face. She has a runny nose. And you can tell they've just been wiping her face all day. And she had a blowout. So they put her change of clothes on a long sleeve shirt. That's not what I sent her to school in. But yeah, so we picked her up. Yep, I'm filming now. Uh, we got um, fish and we got fishing pole and some dead worms. Gianna wanted They're some. Dead. They're not dead? They're alive the in there? Yeah. Open it up. Ooh, gummy worms. Eat it. No. <laughs> so yeah, Q was like, it's a beautiful day. Let's go to the lake. So I guess we're going to the lake. <laughs> And on the way, he stopped to get um, a new fishing pole. He's the type that like keeps his fishing stuff in the back of the truck for days like this. So, I need to wipe your face, baby. Yes, your face. I'm gonna wipe it, I'm sorry. Look, mamas, they have a Moana pole. You want that one? Is that your favorite character? <laughs> She's trying to give her a kiss. Oh, he's so sweet. When I tell y'all my husband is a country man, y'all. <laughs> He's over there. So we found a little fishing spot right by the lake. You can see they're set up over there. And these people got their car stuck in the mud and he's over there. He's made a whole contraption <laughs> to get them out of the mud. <laughs> playing in the dirt. And Gianna, what? is just eating snacks. Oh. <laughs> you want me to hold your hand? Okay. I can't even make this one. Where you wanna go? You better not go this way. You trying to go to the water? Water, yes. Water, good job. Awa? Awa? Yeah. Well, the sun is going down and our impromptu fishing trip <laughs> turned into dirty. helping some friends. Yeah, and Bug got dirty. Because it got mud right there. Helping some people out. And truck so as soon as Q pulls them out, I think we're gonna get on the road back home. Yay! Hold up. No pressure. Do you got it? Yeah. Alright, time to get back to surgery. Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Hold up. No pressure. Oh, oh, oh. No pressure. What the? There ain't no pressure. Seriously? Oh, no. Yes, yes, yes. Oh. Yeah. Oh, my Shots. 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 What's up, guys? So it is the Saturday before Father's Day, and all of my family is in town. Sissy, mom. And then we are at Clyde Warren Park. So let me show you. A super pretty day. Uh, they're about to 
show a movie in the park, so they're kind of getting set up for that. Austin and Hugh are playing catch. <laughs> Yay! Good throw! <laughs> My dad's around here somewhere. There's my dad. So we had so much fun at the park um, and after that the guys came home and brought the kids home and then me and my mom went to the grocery store to try to get everything together for Father's Day tomorrow. So I'm not sure if I've said it already but I've planned like this really fun day at the lake for our like Father's Day activity tomorrow. Um, I rented a boat, I have all of our chairs, we're going to get a good spot by the water. Um, so yeah i'm really excited but the thing is is the whole thing is a surprise like um my dad and q know that we're obviously doing something for father's day but they don't know what so i've been secretly like putting all of our stuff together like packing up our swimsuits and um <laughs> like trying to cook like on the low um so yeah i'm excited secretly packing up q's truck with all of the fun Father's Day stuff, mainly just the food right now, but in a minute I need to get our floaties, um, the ice chest, all of that, so I'm going to try to do it in secret so I don't blow my cover. <laughs> Y'all, so I am sitting in my closet with my cup of coffee, trying not to have a panic attack. <laughs> so as I'm looking out of my window right now, it's pouring rain, and like I said, we were supposed to be surprising my dad and Q with a fishing trip at the lake. I rented the boat. I like, you know, we already kind of like cooked a picnic style meal. Like we made this big brisket. We got like all of the, you know, stuff to go on the side and we were just going to drive out to the lake. I got all the kids like swimsuits and um, I bought like a big like lake floaty and all of that so we could just enjoy a day at the lake. Q loves to fish so that was going to be right up his alley and it is pouring rain. It's been raining. It woke me up. The storm woke me up around five because it was raining so hard and it's still raining. So... Now I'm like, what do we do? The whole day, like that there goes all of my plans the good thing is is that the place that i rented the boat from does have like a rain cancellation policy so that's not a big deal but like that was my entire day like that was the big shebang <laughs> what's your girl supposed to do now so um i'm about to try to collaborate with my mom because we always come up with the best ideas so um yeah BRB. All right, guys, so I look crazy right now, but good news is I think me and my mom came up with a great plan B. So me and my mom came up with the idea of going to the horse race track, which is something that we used to do all the time with my dad. We actually live right next to a horse race track growing up. So um, you can go and, like, if you've never been before the horses actually start racing, 
is going to be next weekend when I surprise Q with his new puppy that he's been, y'all, he's been hounding me about getting a puppy since I was pregnant with Gianna, like at least for the past two years. He's all, because Bruiser is kind of like my dog, you know, if you watched my get to know me video, you guys, like I told that whole story about um, how he surprised me with Bruiser. So he, you know, Bruiser is like my baby. He's been wanting a dog of his own and he wants it to be small because he's so big. He wants like a little baby dog, you know? Um, and I've been like, no, we have a Gianna. You can, Gianna is your baby dog. <laughs> Um, so now I feel like I'm finally in a place where having a dog, I can wrap my mind around it and I really want him to have it. He really wants one, but we can't pick the puppy up until he's eight weeks old. That's like state law. So, um, and that won't be until next weekend. They got it loaded up. Whew. Whew. Okay guys. So me and my mom were able to get it from the back of the truck and then we uh, stopped it with some ice. His favorite beer, and then I'm gonna um, put a bow on top of it, like close it, and put like a big bow on top, and then have him come outside and he'll see it. Okie doke, guys, I think that'll do it. Big pretty bow. Nice. So we made it inside, but it is pouring rain. It's starting to clear up a little bit. I don't know if you guys can tell. You see the rain coming down on the window, but yeah. So there's a delay. We're just hanging out, waiting for it to clear up. Here, baby. Say thank you. You so big. See the horse? You wanna bet? You wanna win some money? So out here, there's some outdoor seating, but it's still drizzling. So the next race is about to start. I'm wondering if I should try to catch us one of these seats under the pavilion or just stay upstairs like where it's safe, but you can't really see that well. Here you can see everything. And I want Gianna and Austin to be able to see the horses. Whoa, did you see that lightning, Ju? There's Q. <laughs> and Austin and my dad and Jean. She's not even looking at the horses. She's looking at me. Ooh, the gray one is pretty. It's raining, but we're still here. So I, I opted for the bun, the safe option. She's going for it. She's rocking it. What are you doing? Hey guys. 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 Yep, well, that's about it. The guy is on the intercom right now saying that the rest of the races for the day are canceled. They're both playing me right now. <laughs> the races are done, basically. We didn't even get to see one. So, plan B, y'all already saw my plan A down the drain. Plan B, I'm striking out. I feel like Plan B wasn't a complete strike We out, didn't you know? see any races. No, yeah, but we got out of the house, you know? Like, Definitely. we got to see You see where I get my optimism? This is the... my sister. We got... <laughs> we got to see the horses. They were kind of cute. Not a problem. I wanted him to experience his first horse race. He's never been. The drag race. Drag car. Drag, like NASCAR? Uh, not NASCAR. Like but like ra race cars, yeah. oh, drag racing. Yes. Like I know I've never seen that. That's fun. Yeah. They have that here in Dallas. 
Oh, the motor That's speedway, good. right? Oh, good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. So, the moral of the story is, is self love. That's and <laughs> Frito Pie. <laughs> More of the story. We're done eating dinner. Gianna's yep. on the dinner table. <laughs> We're about to play Uno and we have the set where you can like pick your cards. What rules do y'all make up when you put, um, play Uno? So, so far we've got, um, what's the first one? Concentration. So you like go around the table. Yes, concentration. <laughs> and you like pick a color and then everybody's like pink, blue, red, green, you know, and then the first person to mess up has to either draw four or take a shot. And then the second one is going to be, you can pick someone to switch hands with. Um, and then our third one is the first person to fill in the blank. So if I play the card, it says the first person to, I could say, okay, the first person to pick up their phone or the first person to need to go to the bathroom has to either draw four or take a shot. Q won the first one. Yeah, this is what I got. It? It's what I'm working with. Look, it has a line right here, but where the circle is, then it's a six. I mean, it has a, if it has a, don't know why, but it's just a line right here, then it's a nine. Which one do you want to play? This one? Okay, we got to wait till our turn now. Let's take that shot. Let's take that shot. Take it, take it. It's now a state. Update, guys. So, um, one of the cards is um, a wild card. On the wild card, it says a round of concentration. If you lose, you have to draw four or you take a shot. Just played that card and ended up being the one to have to take a shot. Because so, Chicago, unbeknownst to us, hey, Chicago. Hey. I did not need to say Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> I had a, I have a lot of friends that just moved to Chicago, so it was on my mind. <laughs> <laughs> and nothing in the game of concentration. Hey, right. hey, hey, right. hey, shut, shut. What's up, guys? So it is. What is today? It's Friday. So um, I'm whispering because Q is upstairs and. He's really quiet. He could like sneak in here like a ninja and I wouldn't even know. So um, yeah, it is Friday and last night I text the breeder to ask him if we could pick him up a day early. Like, please, please, please. Because tomorrow Q wants to drive to Tyler to visit his grandma. And so I'm like, of course you would want to do something like that when I actually have plans to surprise you. So, um, but luckily the breeder obliged. I just got home from Pilates, that's why I look crazy. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, follow me. If you do, then you know that I've been super committed and into Pilates lately. So I just got home from that. So I'm just like trying to comb out my hair. But the thing is, is the breeder was like, yeah, cool, you can come or you can get them on Friday, but, you have to come to me an hour and a half away. <laughs> That's the price you gotta pay when you wanna, you know, ask people for favors because if I waited until tomorrow, he was going to meet me like halfway. But we're not doing anything today. Um, I already dropped Gianna off at school. I worked out. I've been trying to figure out how I can convince Q for us to like go on this mini road trip without him thinking anything of it. Like, hey babe. You wanna jump in the car and drive to Oklahoma? <laughs> uh, yeah, so I haven't figured that part out yet, but um, we should be leaving soon and I will keep you guys posted.
it a long ride? Oh, Hi, cutie. <laughs> we can give you a little bath when we get home. Yep. Oh, home? Yeah, That's all you. <laughs> What's up, man? That's where he's had his two shots. That's where he's been one. Okay, great. Just show this to your vet. He'll know. If you have any questions, you can call me. Alrighty, we'll will do. How big do they get? Yeah, 10 to 15 pounds. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's up, man? Yeah, I see that tail wagon. Yeah, I see Aww. that tail wagon. <laughs> Come on, give me some love. Come on, give me some I love. I know it. I know it. Yes, that's him. That is him. <laughs> yeah. What's up, big man? What's up, big oh man? Oh my gosh. What's up, big man? You are gonna get so much love. Hey. And you're gonna see your big brother, Bruiser, Bruiser, and just mm. think on it. No rush. No rush. I think I'm gonna go with Roscoe. Bruiser and Roscoe. Does he look like a chicken and waffle? <laughs> like a little um, chicken leg. Chicken, too. chicken tender. Yeah. Oh, you like Roscoe? The name? <laughs> what do you think Gianna's gonna say when she sees him? Well, you know, she can only say a few words, but. You, you give me all the kisses. I know you just love me. I know it. We met the guy. Oh yeah, so on our way hey, here, the guy some, said we didn't have to drive. Yeah, give me some We are at PetSmart now. About to get him some new stuff. I did good, babe. This is I'm setting the bar too high. You even want? I mean, you just surprised me with the whole Chip and Joe thing, like. Yeah. Is it good? My father's day gift. What's up, man? <laughs> hey, what flavor? What flavor? Like, what do you mean? Like, bruises and chocolate and Roscoe is a breed. Not flavor, but a breed. What breed is he? Yeah, so he is a. He's a red micro mini golden doodle. So like That's bruiser, huh? That's a good flavor. <laughs> no, book. It's not called flavor. A breed. A breed. Yes. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Give me my dog. <laughs> <laughs> you want a cop? Is he too young for a cop? Um, I'm not sure. Micro. Me, oh, micro. Also, it's not getting big. 10 is no 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 bigger than 10 pounds. Oh, just got a little purse dog. Yeah, no no no. Uh, I got a little purse dog. Oh, <laughs> you this is how I know he likes it. He's FaceTiming all of his friends. What did you think we were gonna do today? Uh-huh. You were just down for whatever? Oh boy, you about to be so bougie. It's on the tag, so Roscoe it is. Roscoe Dash. Roscoe Dash? His name is Roscoe, his middle name is Dash. AC. AC. <laughs> Alright guys, we got Bruiser a new tag too. They're so cute. He is super laced. We got Bruiser some new dog food. Headed back to the house. Well, actually, to pick up Gianna from school. Chunks, give me some kisses. Give me some kisses. You want to see Roscoe? <laughs> so see kisses. Oh <laughs> my, yay! <laughs> Nice 
That's our new puppy. You want to give him a big hug? Mm. Oh, daddy, a big hug. Mm. Okay. Mm. <laughs> She's like, don't forget. Daddy, hey. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, kitty. Kitty patootie. Oh. You have to be nice. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Well, today has been a super exciting day. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with us and seeing our new little addition to our family. I'm so happy Roscoe's home, and you guys can tell he's fitting right in with the family. So, um, oh, yeah, this is my first small dog. Like, I've never, I've always had big dogs growing up. So, if you guys have small dogs and have any tips, or like things that we should expect or you think we should know, leave it down in the comments. Help your girl out. Uh, don't forget to subscribe before you go and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.